Hey guys, so the Pixel 6 is for sure gonna be an exciting one not only cause of its in-house CPU, the white chapel, but also in terms of the camera. See, Google has been using same old sensor from last few years, the Sony IMX378. It is a 12 megapixel sensor and brands like Xiaomi are using it in their budget devices. So it's not an expensive one, but Google's software processing and their pixel visual core makes images shot using IMX378 look amazing. But now the situation is Samsung, Huawei and Xiaomi have taken the lead in this game with better image sensor, the high resolution image sensor which can shoot detailed images like the 48 megapixel one or 108 megapixel camera can shoot high quality images. So even if you zoom in the image, you will notice more details and that's where Google failed with the Pixel 5 and the IMX378. Yeah, not to mention the sensor size is small and this means it won't capture more light. So yeah, surprising news is the Pixel 6 is likely gonna fix that. Michal Rahman says there is a huge chance Google may use Samsung sensor in their main or telephoto lens. He has found some source code in Gcam which shows similar pattern used in Samsung Mate sensor. In addition to this, he says super resolution zoom works on phone with Samsung Mate sensor without root. So this is surely exciting. Yeah, we may see Samsung GN1 or GN2, no information on that. But what we know is they are using Samsung Mate CPU, Samsung Mate image sensor and of course Samsung display. So this all with Google's software integration is like something we all are waiting for. Google will also be using new front camera which will support shooting 4K videos. So yeah, this all hints a huge camera upgrade is for sure coming. Some initial new information on GS101 AK White Chapel for Pixel 6. So this information says it's not gonna be as powerful as Exynos 2100 or Snapdragon 888 cause Exynos and Qualcomm use high power core which demands more battery life. The GS101 will use low power core and this will allow them to save battery life and this means less heating as well. Yeah, you can expect the performance is gonna be similar to last year's Snapdragon 865 5G CPU which is again super fine. The 865 was an amazing and less power consuming CPU. I haven't seen any lags or frame drop even in games of 2021. The 5G modem Google is planning to use has codename Shannon which is similar to what Samsung used in the Exynos CPU. So yeah, this all sounds exciting for sure. Some renders of the Pixel watch coming in from John Prosser. Yeah, it shows we have circular design with curve edges. Yeah, surely looks stunning. You can see there are ridges which will allow you to size it accordingly. And again, this looks so good. Just cannot wait. Some news on the Pixel 5a. Google have given official confirmation. It is surely coming. Catch is, it's coming to the US and Japan and this may be cause of CPU shortage or they want to focus on Pixel 6 like they want to sell Pixel 6 more than the Pixel 5a cause last year we saw Pixel 4 is selling more than the Pixel 5 series so yeah, this is surely a bad news cause Pixel 5a being exclusive to the US and Japan and not coming to markets like UK or India which is disappointing for sure. This is all guys, thanks so much for watching, like, subscribe and I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.